I want your soul. Give me your soul. <laughs> A lot of people attach different names to what I do. Some people say it's just makeup. Some people say uh, it's a waste of time. <laughs> Some people think it's, you know, scary SFX makeup, but it's way more than that. I mean, it's a mixture of everything. My name is Osefan Wadiale, and I am a creative makeup artist. I'm a graduate of Covenant University. I studied civil engineering in school and I'm actually a practicing engineer, <laughs> graduate engineer anyway. Um, I started creative makeup um, by mistake actually. Um, a friend of mine reached out to me and she was like, oh why don't you do something like this, you know? And I was like, okay fine, why not? And I tried it and it was, I was so amazed that I could actually pull it off. And since then, I never turned back, <laughs> I just kept Pushing myself and kept Okay, so after the first time I tried it, um, my family was really shocked and they were psyched about it. So, like, they were very supportive about it. And they, my mom and dad showed every single person on their contact list, like, see what my daughter did. Um, from outsiders, on the other hand, I mean, I got mixed response. So, for some for, for some people, I go, oh my god, wow, this is amazing. How many hours did this take? This is wow. And then some people were just like. Why? I mean, why are you wasting your time? So much product, why are you, why, what's the purpose of doing this? For materials, not that much actually. You'd be shocked because you'd expect that it would take a lot. But most of the things I've been using, I'm using them for like about three years and I don't need to replace them. Just few things that need to replace. Look at me, I put a Look at me, I put a show on when I go home. When it comes to time, on an average, I spend like about six hours, six hours, six, seven hours, if I'm lucky, maybe five hours on a look. I've spent up to like 12 hours once. I think that's the longest I've gone doing a makeup look, but yeah. That's... So it takes a lot of time because it requires a lot of details to make it look realistic. They are actually all safe products. As you can see, most of them are things I use for like normal makeup. Um, these ones that are for specifically body paints are specifically body paints. I mean, they're for face painting and I haven't had any issues with them. Although if you were to use any of these, I'd advise you to try it on a patch of skin first just to make sure that you don't react to anything in it. But aside from that, they're all safe. They're cruelty free also. So, so um, this is a passion for me. Uh, I haven't made it into a business yet because it's okay. I'm trying to pursue my engineering profession for now, and also I am trying to be an influencer. So I'm building up to that, trying to work with brands and just teach people about um, how to do creative makeup. Um, I mean, there's there's been a lot of times where I wanted to quit. You know, because everybody keeps telling me you're wasting time so, and it's not bringing money so there's no point but then you know how some people just eat because they like it makes them happy and people just buy things because it makes them happy that's kind of how makeup is for me I mean sometimes I pick up my brush and I don't even realize the amount of time I've spent you know it just makes me so happy and I think in life that's something that's very important mm -hmm.